In the vast expanse of ancient Egypt, where the sun's golden rays painted the desert sands with hues of amber and ochre, there lived a divine entity known as Horus, the celestial guardian and protector of the pharaohs. His story, woven into the tapestry of Egyptian mythology, is a tale of power, loyalty, and the eternal struggle between order and chaos. Horus, the son of the revered god Osiris and the goddess Isis, was born under the celestial canopy, his arrival heralding a new era of hope and prosperity for the land of Egypt. As the god of the sky, he soared through the heavens, his falcon wings outstretched, his piercing gaze surveying the realm below. His very presence brought solace to the people, assuring them of divine protection and guidance. From his celestial perch, Horus watched over the pharaohs, the earthly embodiments of the gods. He was their guardian, their champion, and their unwavering ally. With his divine powers, he shielded them from harm, guided their decisions, and ensured their reign was just and prosperous. The pharaohs, in turn, revered Horus as their divine patron, offering him prayers, sacrifices, and elaborate ceremonies to honor his majesty. But the path of Horus was not without trials and tribulations. His greatest adversary was Set, the god of chaos and darkness, who sought to usurp the throne of Osiris and plunge Egypt into an abyss of eternal night. Set, consumed by envy and ambition, plotted against his brother, treacherously murdering him and scattering his body parts across the land. Horus, driven by grief and a burning desire for vengeance, embarked on a quest to restore his father's honor and reclaim the throne that rightfully belonged to him. He traversed the treacherous deserts, navigated the treacherous waters of the Nile, and descended into the depths of the underworld, facing countless trials and tribulations along the way. With the aid of his loyal companions, including the goddess Isis, the god Thoth, and the four sons of Horus, he pieced together the scattered remains of Osiris and resurrected him from the realm of the dead. The triumphant return of Osiris brought balance and order back to the cosmos, reaffirming the supremacy of light over darkness. Horus, having avenged his father and restored harmony to the land, ascended to the throne as the rightful pharaoh of Egypt. He ruled with wisdom, justice, and compassion, ushering in an era of unprecedented prosperity and peace. His reign was marked by bountiful harvests, flourishing trade, and the construction of magnificent temples and monuments that stood as testaments to his divine power. The people of Egypt rejoiced under the benevolent rule of Horus. They celebrated his victories, honored his divine lineage, and sought his guidance in times of need. Horus, the sky god and protector of the pharaohs, became an integral part of their daily lives, a symbol of hope, strength, and unwavering devotion. As the centuries passed, the legacy of Horus continued to inspire and awe generations of Egyptians. His story was immortalized in hieroglyphs, carved into the walls of temples, and depicted in intricate works of art. His image adorned amulets, talismans, and jewelry, serving as a reminder of his divine presence and protection. Even today, the tale of Horus, the celestial guardian and defender of the pharaohs, remains a testament to the enduring power of ancient Egyptian mythology. His story continues to captivate and inspire, reminding us of the eternal struggle between light and darkness, the importance of loyalty and justice, and the unwavering belief in divine protection.